Oh god, that is terrible. What is happening? Hello everybody, my name is Mr. Leomo. Welcome back to Crazy Craft. Do you like my hot dog hat on my head? I like it. That is the best hat you could possibly get. Uh, yeah, welcome back to Crazy Craft. This is episode 17. If you're enjoying this series, make sure you hit that like button down below. Show me you're enjoying this series so much that you just you just want more, like Alvin, Alvin the Chipmunk. I think he's, he's actually my pet now. He's just running around like a crazy little chipmunk that he is. I've used all my apples on him, and he, he came down the hole with me. That sounds really wrong, but <laughs> he came into the crazy cave with me, I should say. And now I've got Alvin the Chipmunk, but I can't figure out how we make him sit or anything. Oh, there we go. He just sat. Hey! Now he's there, he can guard the entrance, right? We need another one there. Oh, maybe not. He, he just does what he wants. He does what he wants. He's Alvin. He does what he wants. <laughs> Welcome back, dudes. Today, in today's episode... Oh, I'm a cookie slime. Cookie slime! Today's episode, we are going on a quest. We're going on an adventure. The toughest quest in the whole of Crazy Craft. Today, we are going to try... And I mean try. That That is the key word there. We're going to try, we're going to attempt to get the most powerful armor in the game and the best weapon in the game, the Royal Guardian armor. Now the way you do that, there's like a little dungeon. If you remember quite a few episodes ago we went into one of the ant dimensions and there was a little dungeon and everything came out and it tried to attack me and I was like, no, I'm not going near that. I'm going to die and I flew away. But today we're going to go back. We've reinforced, we've got pretty much everything we can get to, to be as good as possible to beat this dungeon and I've got a little sneaky way that I'm gonna kind of try and cheat the dungeon. I've got a little sneaky way. Brian, you're... Actually, if I had a really good weapon, Brian could come with me and she'd probably help, but she could die. And I don't want to risk that, Brian. You can stay there, Brian. We need to get some poppets. That's what I was gonna do. So what I've been doing over here... Yeah, I think Alvin likes to dig holes. That, that, is, that is something else. Alvin likes to dig holes. What was that explosion? <laughs> I just heard an explosion. Oh god. Wait, is the... Oh, Fred's not here. Oh yeah, there he is. There he is. Alright, Fred. I need Fred. Look, there's a little hole down there and another chipmunk. I think I think Alvin is trying to get to that other chipmunk down there. I don't know how that happened or why it happened, but ever since I brought Alvin down into the crazy cave, there's been massive holes that it's been on dirt, but whatever happens, happens. I need Fred, so Fred better not disappear. What I'm going to do is I'm going to make more poppets, so I need... I go like this, boom, right, there we go. Let's see how many poppets we can make, and then we will try and become really overpowered. So then if our armor breaks or anything whilst we're in this dungeon, it shouldn't break because of the poppets, which which would be good, right? Wait, what am I doing? I need to put I need to put as many as I can. One, two, three, four. All right, boom. There we go. I've made five. <laughs> I need more wool though. Oh man, you need you need so much stuff to make witchery stuff. All right, come here, Jess. That that is not food for you. Okay, Jess or I I don't even know what you're called, Jess or Garfield. One of them. <laughs> One of them. All right, let's put all that stuff back in there. Get a bone needles. I think I got them. Get it. Get out of here. Bone needles in there, and then for what I need. I've got all of these different things that we make in the distillery here. I've made loads of them, and we need to decide what we want. We've got an armor protection one. I really want a death one, in case we die. That, that could come very handy, so we'll check what the death one is, and it'll make a few more as well. So we've got diamond vapor and drop of luck, and then we need some gold nuggets. So, diamond vapor, drop of luck. Where you at? Where you at? Where are you? Have I, have I not got a drop of luck? Balls. Well, I've not got a drop of luck, apparently. What? What? How do we get a drop of luck? I'm going to get one of those guys. Drop of luck. This guy. I, what? How have I not got that? I swear I went and got... Oh, what, whatever happens, happens. Right. Oh, we just need to craft this one, then. So, I can craft that, and I'll be back with you in a second. All right. There we go. That should be good. I got myself some gold, so we'll turn that into nuggets. Oh, i got loads of nuggets now. And I just needed... A poppet of this guy, Death Poppet. Right, let's see what we can do with this guy then. Where is he? This one. Right. Golden nuggets, golden nuggets. I could probably make two of these guys. I, I could make more. I'll make two and then I'll see what else I can make. So there's Death Protection one. We'll make another one. Where? Oh, golden nuggets there. Boom. 
We'll see which other ones we can get as well, because they'll probably all be useful. There we go, we'll get two death protection ones. So we'll put a diamond vapor back, put a drop of luck back, and... Oh, I had loads of gold in there as well. <laughs> My bad. My bad. And then we... What else do we want? A voodoo... Actually, a voodoo puppet. That's what I wanted to make. A voodoo one. Because I want to try something out with the voodoo. I want to try something... I'm not sure if I'll do it in this episode, but I've got an idea for the voodoo puppet. Oh, I don't think we've got all of that stuff. Oh, uh, if not, we've got... The XL Horned one, we've got Mandrake Group, but we've not got Fermented Spider Eye or the Belladonna Flower. We've not got any of those, so we'll have to do that one at another time. But that will be definitely, that will definitely be useful. What's this one? Vampiric Poppet. Oh, is that the one I need? I either need Voodoo or Vamp... I think I need Vampiric, you know. Because what I'm trying to do is, if I use the Vampiric Poppet on Mobzilla, I think, or on the King or something... I think that means that when I take damage, the damage actually goes to the thing that it's bound with. So if Mobzilla attacks me, it's basically attacking itself. I don't know if that's how it works, but I've got a theory. I'm not sure it's a vampiric one or Voodoo. I think it's vampiric, but I've not got the Wool of Bat anyway, so we'll have to do that another time. But that is one of my smooth ideas. <laughs> one of my smooth ideas. Right, we might as well make another armor one. And there we go. Right, so we've got two death ones, another armor one. And then we want to do one more, because we've got another puppet, so we might as well do one more. So which one should we go for? Earth, or should we... Actually, let's go for a tool one. Because then, I don't think... This one. Tool. Oh, no, we need more drops of luck. I've not got any more drop of luck. Balls. We can't do that one, then. Uh, well, vampiric. No. Uh, earth protection. No. I've not got any of that stuff. Right. That's, that's enough for today, then. I think that is enough for today. We just need to bound that to me, and then we can go and take on this dungeon see what's going to happen with this dungeon i'm excited dudes we could potentially get the best weapon and armor in the game as well as a nice little dragon pet which would be pretty sweet or we could get absolutely owned and i might cry myself to sleep <laughs> it could happen it could happen i think we need a bottle for this so i will drink this water oh not the altar i want to do that right bottle and we need a bone needle and if i'm right i'm a genius all right let's go over to my bed Let's go over to my bed. Let's right click. Oh no. Right, so right click. And then my idea was I right click Mobzilla with this, bound it to a vampiric puppet, and then he will take the damage that he does on me and basically kill himself. If that works, let me know in the comments if that would work. I'm not sure if it would work or not, but if it does, I am a genius. <laughs> if it does. Oh, we need a. Ah, oh, balls. Oh no. We're only going to be able to do three of them because I've not got another bottle. Ah, oh, balls. <laughs> no. <laughs> Alright, it doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. We'll just do three, and then we're good to go. I'm too good to die anyway. <laughs> Famous last words or what? No, I don't know what's going to happen, but we'll just do these ones, these poppets, on a little shelf. I think I've lost one. I swear I had two before. But, oh well, it doesn't really matter. i got two armor ones now and two death protection ones, so that should save me a little bit. But what else have I, I got to show you? The enchanted golden apple farm up above. Jess, what are you doing? You're supposed to be sitting. What, what is Alvin doing? Alvin is just making mischief everywhere. Right, the ant is still there, good. You can stay there. Alright, let's just go up. Is it is it night time, though? No. Okay, alright, let's go up. That little chipmunk at the bottom of the stairs, I don't know what that dude's doing. We'll go up, we'll get ourselves some golden apples, because I've been breeding them like rabbits. No, breeding them like a golden apple farm. <laughs> As you can see, there's quite a few... That guy's got a hat on. So is that guy. It's a Mr. T enchanted cow. And it look, by the looks of things, the ants like them. The ants are like, oh yeah, Mr. T, quit your chip. Oh no, that's what Mr. T's like. <laughs> I'm going to keep the Mr. T one, because it's just so awesome. It's just so awesome, I'm going to keep him. And then, alright, I'm going to get killing some of these pretty quickly, so I can get a few golden apples, and then I can get out of here, because it's night time. Because it's night time, I can get out of here. Wait, wait, you can, you can stop. No, stop it. Get out of here. Right, give me that as well. Thank you very much. Right, I got a few golden apples. That's good, I don't want to kill them all, because obviously, uh, then I won't be able to breed them anymore. <laughs> and that wouldn't be too good. Alvin, what are you doing? No, Alvin. Calm yourself, Alvin. And I've got myself a little wheat farm here, so I can have wheat and then breed them. And it's pretty good. Let's go down here. Sweet. I got five enchanted ones, which should be enough, really. And then ten normal ones, but I don't know how it's going to go. I don't know how it's going to go. Oh, I'm a moth. I forgot. Moths don't like water. I'm sorry. All right, Alvin, you're going to have to stay here. You can't come on this adventure with me, Alvin. You just can't. You cannot come on this adventure with me. Nope. 
Oh, <laughs> man. Right. Alright, okay. I guess Alvin might have to come then. Let's do this. Go to the unstable land dimension. Away. Come on. No, no. Away. <laughs> yeah. Alright. I am on my way to greatness. Oh, why does it have to be dark? Why does it have to be dark? Alright, Alvin has come with me for some strange reason. Maybe he could bring good luck. I don't know. Maybe. I doubt it though, but you never know. Oh, what the hell is that? An amethyst block. Sweet. I don't really need it though. And the nightmares everywhere. My god. This place is definitely not something you want to mess with. I'm looking for a dungeon though. I need to be on the lookout for a dungeon. So keep your eyes peeled, dudes. And if we can find one, we can absolutely blitz it. And do a little sneaky cheat that I've been thinking of. A little sneaky cheat. Oh, is this one? Is this one? Yep. I think this is one. Yep, that's it. That is what I'm talking about. That is the dungeon. So, what this mod is supposed to do, because this is part of the Orspawn mod, what this is supposed to do is you're supposed to walk up, you're supposed to like get your way all the way to the top, go through, fight your way all the way to the bottom, and then get all the loot. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go through the bottom, I'm going to use a gravity gun, I'm going to get my way through, shoot the iron blocks away, and then get all the loot. So I've got to deal with whatever mobs at the bottom though, but it means that I don't have to go all the way to the top and all the way through the bottom. Even though that would be fun to do, I would probably rage my balls off as well because I would get really annoyed and I'd probably die. Which wouldn't be good, but we've got our golden apples at the ready in case we need them. I think I might have one just before we go in, just in case. So I don't want to die. I need to do this swiftly and quickly and effectively. I need to be the best moth there ever was. So, right, let's do this then. If I die, it doesn't really matter because i got two death protection puppets. So I've got three lives pretty much. Yes! Alright, let's do this then. Golden apple. Alright, let's go in. Gravity gun. Oh, it looks like Emperor Scorpions, I think. Alright, if this works. If this works. No, it doesn't freaking work. It doesn't freaking work. Why does it not work? Oh no. I can't do it. Can I mine my way through? I can. Yes, gravity gun doesn't work. But I can mine my way through. That is good. Alright, you can get out of here. You can get out of here, you little poop. Right, come on. Where's my little hole? There it is. And mine. Mine. No, get out. What are you doing, Nightmare? What are you doing? No, stop it. Get out of here. Right, come on, I need to get my little hole. I need to get my little hole in. Boom, I'm in. I'm in. No, get, just, no. Stop yourself. Right, and through the hole. Through the freaking hole. Yes, I'm in. Now, just to destroy this. Just to destroy- no. Oh, I've got to destroy it. i got to destroy it. How are the cloud- that cloud shark? Freaking annoying. Right, I'm going to have to destroy everything in here. Because what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to- look, there's holes everywhere. And if you go up there, there'll be another layer of- I don't know what that is. Hercules beetle, and then if you keep going up, that, that is what happens. But I need to destroy this. Boom. Boom. They can't- they- Oh god, that is terrible. What is happening? I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's happening. I'm just gonna have to kill all these Emperor Scorpions with the Big Bertha. Oh, I take. Oh no, there's one more. There's one more. That's gonna be the hardest one as well. Oh crap. Oh no, I should have brought some of my uh, potions. Ha, oh, why didn't I think of that? Why didn't I think of that? I got one more. Alright, golden apple just in case. Just in case. Alright. Okay, I think there's an OP Scorpion somewhere. But. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, dudes. Alright, I'm gonna have to go right above it. Drop down and hope that, oh, if I had a thunder staff, I could just blow it up. Oh, why did I not do that? Why did I not do that? Okay, take it out. Take it out. Oh, no. Did I get it? Come on. Come on. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Oh, balls. Come on. Oh, this is going to be harder than I thought. My God. Get out of here. Get out of here, cobweb. All right. Sweet. Very nice. You're very nice, very nice, very nice. Get out, go, Emperor Scorpions. This is the most terrifying place I've ever been in my life. I'm going to have to just try and kill some of them and then take out the spawner. That's what I'm going to have to do. Big Bertha, do your job. I know you're not, you're not the best thing in the world, but you, you're doing pretty well. You're doing pretty well. Pretty well. Imagine if I didn't have Big Bertha, though. Oh, no. Why did loads of them have to spawn, then? Why did loads of them have to spawn, then? They're shooting freaking fire at me. Oh, wait. If he shoots that at me, I could flame it back. And then... Yes! I got it, dudes! I freaking got it! Right. Now, 
Let's just own these mother truckers. Let's own them. There's only three left. Oh, there's tons of little ones, though. There's tons of little ones. All right, let's have another golden apple because we don't really need to save them because we've got a whole factory at home. It's a massive nightmare outside just looking at me like, what you doing, man? Yeah, get out of here. Get out of here. Right, now it's just time to clean up. Wait, where's the... Where's the loots? Or maybe you get them after you kill everyone. I don't know, though. Where's where's the loots? <laughs> where's the loots? There's so many little ones. Oh, God, that made a loud noise. Jeez. All right, that's the poisons, I think. Oh, my God. There's so many little dudes. There's so many little dudes. I don't know what to do. All right, let's get in the corner and just wreck face. Let's just wreck face, right? You can't get near me. Oh, maybe they can. They owned me. This is crazy. There's so many of them. What the balls? Right, my ultimate armor is standing up pretty well. It's standing up pretty well. Uh, I need. I just need to get rid of all these scorpions, though. I don't like these scorpions, man. I don't like them. And there doesn't... I swear there's supposed to be a chest with, like, really good loot. I swear there's supposed to be a chest. But there doesn't seem to be any. What is going on? Maybe they spawn in when you're at the top, so you don't have... So you can't cheat. Maybe I've been cheated myself. Maybe that's what happened. Oh, no. Right, well, I'm going to find out what's happened. And I'm going to clear this whole area, get all these experience points. Because look how many there are. It's so much of everything. And I will be back with you in a little bit. Alright, dudes, I'm back. I've cleared out this whole area from all the scorpions. And I think I have made a bit of a schoolboy error. I think I've made a bit of a noob mistake. So if we go up here, where's the hole? Up here. Uh, that, that is not what she said. Up here. I've cleared out this area. This was Hercules Beetle. And I think... I'm pretty sure that the Royal Guardian armor is going to be in these chests, not at the bottom. So I, I, I probably just made the biggest noob mistake ever. I am a noob. You can call me a noob. It's all right. I, I'll be called a noob for that because that, that was a little bit nooby. But there we go. A diamond block. Wait. <laughs> that looks ridiculous. That looks absolutely ridiculous. A blaze with a hot dog hat on. Oh yeah, they see me roll it right. No, no time. This isn't a time for messing about. This is a time for. Oh, no, that's not what I wanted. Wait, we can get thunder stuff though because then we can destroy or we can try and destroy some of the spawners. Please say this is it. I got a freaking ray gun, dudes. I got a freaking ray gun. I don't know. <laughs> if that's good or not, but I got a freaking ray gun and I don't think I want anything else out of that. I don't even know what that is. I think that's a nightmare spawn egg, but I'm not too sure. Over here. Oh, I don't think it's here, dudes. Right, maybe I'm not a big noob. Maybe it's just not spawned in here. Another ray gun. I'll just take one of them. Has it not spawned in here? What is going on? Why, is it, why am I not getting this armor? Alright, maybe we have to go up one more. I don't know, though. Am I just getting pooped off? Or is there only a chance that it'll spawn in? Is there just a chance it'll spawn in? Can I ray gun people? Yeah, I'm, I'm going to ray gun a lot of people. <laughs> I'm going to ray gun a lot of people. Alright, let's go up one more. Uh, we might as well see if we can fight our way out. Or just, just a little bit. Let's see how far we can go. Where's the hole? Where's the freaking hole? Maybe I can't go up. <laughs> where's the hole? Am I being an idiot or something? I can't see where the freaking hole is. Oh, there it is. Corner mode. Right. Oh, whoa, what the balls. You can't even, I can't even fly. I cannot even fly. Freaking basilisks. That is ridiculous. That is ridiculous. You can't do anything. No, that is so stupid. Alright, let's just get in there. I cannot get... I can't get in. <laughs> I can't get in. And now I can't even do damage to them. I cannot fly. I can't do anything. That is... That is dumb. That is next level dumbness. That is next level dumb. Right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get out of here. Because this is, this is where you get the Royal Guardian. I'm almost certain of it. If I've missed it, then that bit idiotic but I'm gonna go find another dungeon and then I'm gonna see what we can get 
Alright dudes, I've cleared out another dungeon in this magical mystery realm and hopefully there'll be some royal guardian stuff down here. I just got rid of this because you've already seen me take on the scorpions, you don't want to do that again. But here we should have... What the balls? You can get... No, no, no. But where'd he go? <laughs> that guy just go? He just did a hit and run on me. That guy just did a serious hit and run on me. Alright, where's... There we go. Up here. Right. Let's go do this then. This is not going to be like the Basilisk one. I've taken these guys out before. And they're not too bad. They are not too bad. Wait, can we just do this and just... Oh, don't get stuck. Can we do this and does this work? Does it destroy... I don't think it does destroy them, you know. Alright, let's just take these guys out then. Uh, I've taken these out before. Oh, he's shooting fire at me, the little cheeky... Cheeky little Hercules beetle. What is he trying to do? These guys really aren't too hard. They're really not the best. The only annoying thing is when you go over to the spawners... And they all knock you away. That is the only annoying thing. But I shouldn't be too bad if I go like this. Oh, no, loads just more. No, loads more just spawned. Oh, that's poop. Oh, that's poop. Come on, big, bigorous Bertharus. Show me what you got. Show me what you what you got. Those guys just decided to die. All right? No, come on. Get in the hole. Oh, god damn it. That one. That one. It's just stuck in the hole itself. Stop your jibber jabber. No. Oh, no more than freaking... Sp oh, my God. Imagine doing this with the Basilisks. That would be so bad. That would be so freaking bad. More of them just sport... Well, at least I get loads of experience. That's one... Oh, I could just go in the chests, to be fair. I don't have to wait. I could just go in the chests. Right, as soon as I'm in, then that's all right. Oh, I got one of them. Got one of them. Boink. And I'm in. All right, sweet. There we go. Taking them out. And all I gotta do now is take you guys down. That's right. I just gotta take you guys down and then hope in the chests that there's gonna be stuff. Ah, uh, all this XP, dudes. All this XP for a blip. Oh, what is this basilisk doing? Sort yourself out, my friend. No. Well, we've got loads of diamond blocks and stuff now. We've got 140 levels. My goodness me. That basilisk is having a rave party through the floor. Right. Come on. I'm gonna eat this last golden apple in hope that there's going to be good stuff in here. Oh, yes! Yes! Okay, there's the good stuff in this one. Yes, the prince. Now this is a little dragon guy that I'm going to show you at the end of this episode. It's like a mini version of the king. And the king is a massive uh, dragon with three heads. So it's a mini... Yes! Alright, this is it, dudes. This is it. Right, Royal Guardian boots. Look how... Look at the enchantments. Just look. It's just out of this world. That is bananas. That is absolutely cray cray. And then we've got this guy. And this guy. Who do we want that for? Stop hammer time. We don't really need a hammer. Actually, it'd be quite cool to have that in the armory. It would be quite cool to put that in the armory. So, uh, let's put the hoe in there. We can make another hoe. We can make another hoe, is that it? Oh, yes, the sword. I forgot about that. I almost forgot about the sword. That would not have been very clever. Look how many ultimate swords I've got as well. I got so many ultimate swords. That's awesome. Right, let's get that in our bellies. And there we go. Oh, wait, wait. I've got to be myself. Just wait for this. Just, just wait for this, dudes. Boom! Look at this beast! Oh, my God. <laughs> I've never seen one this big in my whole life. And I've heard that one before. <laughs> Jeez. Look, it doesn't even fit on the screen. Oh, there we go. Look. Look at that. Compared to Big Bertha... Boom. Big Bertha looks tiny compared to that thing. I thought Big Bertha was big. And then look at that. Th what the balls. What are the actual balls. If we can dual wield Big Bertha and the Royal Guardian Sword. My God. Wait, can we test it out on some basilisks? Can we test it out? Are they up here? I don't think it'd do that much, actually. Let's, let's just be a moth, right? It's got... Unbreaking five. Okay, so we could put it on a little enchantment thing at home and then oh, You know what the basilisks aren't even worth it. Look at that. They're, they're not even worth it They give you so no, I've, I've got all I came for. I'm gonna get out of here We need to find ourselves an ant and then we can get back. Look, that's what that's what the thunder staff did <laughs> It just blew a massive hole in it Die Satan spawn All right, there we go. We need to find ourselves an ant and then we'll be good to go and we hopefully don't have to come back here ever again. But you never know. You never know what could happen. Alright. What are you? Cellularosaurus. 
Right, let's find ourselves an ant, and we will be good. Then we can put on our new awesome stuff, which is the best stuff in the game. And we've got it. And we've got it, dudes. Right, we'll put it on, we'll sort everything else, and we get back to the crazy cave. And, oh, I will take that. Don't mind if I do. Come on. I, I kind of want to find an ant. Kind of. Wait, why does it do that? <laughs> why does it go like that? Oh, I can't see anything. Oh, now I can. Is it something to do with me being a moth, hey? Some kind of moth discrimination. I hope not. There we go. I've learned how to teleport as well. We're back. We're back, dudes. Wait, I, I gotta swag myself up. So we go into Brian and Jess the Cat and Alvin the Chipmunk. I gotta swag myself out. And then they'll be like, whoa, what the hell? Actually, Alvin the Chipmunk came with us, didn't he? But he's not here. <laughs> no, we may have lost Alvin. That ain't good, dudes. That is not good. Right, let's put this fancy stuff on. Let's see what this fancy stuff looks like. We will hold out our Royal Guardian sword with pride. And then we'll go say, what's up, Brian? And I'll say, what's up? Look at that. I'm like a king now. I'm like a king. Do you actually want to mess? Do you? Do, do you actually want... No. <laughs> <laughs> wow. What the balls. All right, let's go down here. Will my sword even fit down this hole? Oh, why did I say that? That, that sounds... That sounds bad. I'm flying. Has that to do with this armour? You like glide down really slowly and gracefully. I am a graceful king. That is why. Bow down to your king. Bow down to me, Brian. I don't think she's going to do anything. But it covers my eyes. I can't even see. I can see through the corner of my eyes and that's about it. But I got the Royal Guardian stuff, which is freaking sweet, Brian. Don't look sexy now. I look freaking sexy. Right, what I'm going to do... Oh, I need to make another armour stand, actually. I can put all my ultimate armour in there. All the ultimate swords I'm going to have to put in the armory. We're going to have to... Man, our armory is going to be stacked. Our armory is too stacked already. And we've got loads of ultimate bows, but I don't think we could put them in here. I don't know why. Oh, God. Sorry, didn't, didn't mean to do that, armory. Don't catch on fire. Don't catch on fire. We could put it in there, though. There we go. That looks, that looks pretty sweet. Put it in there. Uh, we need to make more armory stuff. We need to make more armory space, so I'll do that off camera. Yeah, just throw that in the corner. I don't, I don't really need that. <laughs> just throw it in the corner, man. Just throw it in the corner. All right, Empress Scorpion Scales, put that there. Diamond Blocks, we will put that in there. Look at all these chicken we got from the Mother Clucker. All that KFC chicken. We've got more Miner's Dreams. I got that from in the dungeon somewhere. And now we've got the Prince. Now, I'm not sure what you actually need to tame the Prince, or if you need to tame the Prince, but I'm going to spawn him and see what happens. So, we need a name for the prince, so what your job is in the comments is let me know what a good name for the prince should be, and I will let you know. Prince. Ah, oh, it's Prince. We could just call him Prince, I suppose. Look at him, he's got one black eye, one blue eye, and one red eye. Or is he automatically tamed? I don't know, but this guy is kind of better than Brian, because he follows you about, and he flies as well, whereas Brian just kind of sits there. No, I can't... Oh! I do feed him beef, but nothing really happens because he's got full he's got full hearts. I think we don't even need to do anything. I think we, he's just got us, and he's with us now. What if we right-click him? Does he stay? Hey, I think he does. That is sweet. We've got another pet. So we've lost Alvin, the chipmunk, but we've got a prince that you guys can name. Come up with a pretty cool name, and I will pick the best one in the next episode, hopefully. Hopefully, because I'm going away for a week and possibly a little bit longer soon, so I'm going to have to pre-record some more videos. So I might not be able to check your name for the next one, but don't worry. We'll name him pretty cool something later. But thank you all so much for watching this episode. We've got the best armor, the best weapons, the best everything in the game now, pretty much. But we need to take on the big bosses. That's what we're working up to. We need to take on the big bosses. I'm not sure if there's anything else I can do to become more OP. I'll have a look into it. There's surely something else I can do with Witchery Mod or something. But if you have enjoyed, smash that like button down below. Let's see how many we can get for this episode. Because we've got the beastiest stuff in the whole freaking game. But my name is Mr. Williamo. Thank you all so much for watching. And I'll see you all in the next one. Adios.